I wanna be the very best. The hell is wrong with you now? What do you have here? I don't know. We got this this week. Let's find out. Let's find out what. Ooh. What's in here? Watch it with that knife, man. Come on, let's go. Alright, alright, alright. Pokemon. Pokemon. You gotta say it with enthusiastic, man. Pokemon, man. What he said. Pokemon Pika. Let's go Pikachu with the Pokeball Plus ball. And let's see. This ball right here. Hey. That's where right. Where the hell did you get that from? Don't worry about you it. You mean you had me wait this whole damn time? I didn't even get a chance to play my damn game and you already... Well, here's your game. Go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's see if I can capture you. Put you inside this damn... Man, you almost scared me. <laughs> Alright, let's go. So, got the Pokemon. Let's go. Pikachu version. They have also the... What is it? Eevee? So, guys, um, most of you guys already played it. I'm pretty sure. Have you played it? Isn't it? No, you haven't. Uh, no. <laughs> Because I wanted to wait to unbox this for you guys. Well, yeah. have you played a previous game? Yes, I have. Well, which one have you played? I played the Pokemon Sapphire Edition, which is a couple years ago. A few years, actually, probably like 10, maybe. I played the Omega, I played the Sun, and I played the Blue and the Yellow. And I've already played it. I have about two hours into it. Uh, it's very similar to the Yellow. Uh, Pikachu is always following you, uh, or it's on top of you. Um, now that you bring that up, did you know on the Eevee version, Eevee rides on top of your head the whole time? Eevee. Eevee? I don't know. You guys can correct us. Tell us in the bottom what's the correct pronunciation for the other version of Pokemon. Eevee? Eve? I have no damn idea. Did you guys know that the Pokeball actually has extra functionality besides with the Switch? So if you play Pokemon Go, you can actually connect this to your phone and without looking at the phone because you know you got the people doing this the whole time. I see this at work all the time. Oh, sorry, and you look at their screen and they're playing Pokemon. Like, I don't care, you know, it's like whatever, everybody, whatever toots your horn, that's fine with me. But the case being is this will actually, it serves as an indicator whenever there's a Pokemon close by, it actually vibrates. Mm -hmm. And it, when it vibrates, you press the button. I believe you press the button, and you and you're allowed to capture it without looking at your screen. So this actually works as a remote, I would say. Not sure if you would find it handy. Uh, I don't even think you play Pokemon Go sure anymore. Yeah. The other feature that I love about the uh, Pokeball Plus is that you could uh, unlock Mew. Did you know that? I wasn't aware of that. Exactly, because you're not a damn Pokeball. Anyway, so. And you forgot to tell our viewers that this is also, also, also a Joy-Con controller. So, you know, you don't have to use your uh, Joy-Cons from, uh, from your Switch, sorry. You actually use this, you know, you just sit there and I don't know how that, that looks kind of weird. You're sitting there with a ball in your hand and you're, yeah. So, I don't know. So, you may ask yourself, how do I unlock Mew? I was asking myself that. I didn't know how to unlock it. I even had to go uh, on YouTube and go find out how, how to unlock it. You mean YouTube, our buddy from Florida, right? That's the person that told you how to unlock Mew. Yeah. Ain't no YouTube channel telling you. <laughs> I already know where you go. Yeah, it's your pain. Anyway, so all you gotta do is press this button on top. There's a, there's a button on top of the, uh, the Pokeball. And then you go to options and you go all the way down. It says communications click on communications and then click on gift mystery gift click on it and then it's gonna unlock the sound of Mew and there you go you have Mew and right now that you mentioned sounds let that be the last time you do that <laughs> I was trying to catch um, so what it does you mentioned sounds and going back to me talking about Pokemon Go and this it actually made it emit it emits a sound when you capture the Pokemon Every Pokemon has a distinct sound that it makes, right? Uh -huh. So whatever Pokemon you have in here, it makes that sound. Yeah, because that, you that is, you. Yeah, that yeah. is trapped. So mm -hmm. I, I don't know how it would look walking around <laughs> with, a of, with a lot of people, business people around you in your pocket going, Pikachu! <laughs> 
Yeah, I get it. Yeah, so you know, it's just little features that Nintendo wants to throw in there. But um, yeah, and we're not sponsored or anything, so just. Um, one of the other features that this game has is that you can pet Pikachu. Did you know that? You can pet Pikachu. I didn't know you could pet Pikachu. Now I have, I have two dogs and I have a van picking Pikachu to pet. At least this one's not gonna chew up your But it, it looks weird though petting him though. Because you pet him from the bottom and he's, he raises up his freaking chin. You pet him on top and he closes up his eyes and he goes, Pikachu! You know, it's just weird. What are you doing? Oh, so you pet it from the... Pika Pika! <laughs> okay, anyways. Yeah, it seems like we're having too much fun with this thing right here. But yeah, so... This version costs $99.99. Um, you get the... You could get either the Pikachu or the Eevee version. Um, whatever retailer you prefer. Amazon, Target. But I know you had a hard time trying to... I had it. a hard time. That's what I gave it for... <coughs> Pre-ordering. Uh, yeah, I didn't pre-order it. So I went to my local Target. Sold out. I um, went on their website to see which is the, the the closest location that has the item. Sold out. Sold out. So I had to drive about maybe 20 miles. Yeah, 20 miles. About 20 miles, right? Yeah, 20 miles just to get the the item. So if if you lucked out, keep on looking. Don't don't pay uh, third party. Do yeah. not pay third party. Never pay third party. Yeah. They, you're probably going to get okay, this ripped game. off. I've seen it already for $164.99. That is BS. So Nintendo has these. I, they're probably sold out now. I'm not sure. Correct us if we're wrong. Put it in the comments. But these are set for $49.99 individually. So you get the game oh, yeah. for $59.99. So just get it on bundle. It's cheaper. Yeah, you save $10. Unfortunately, I think the bundles are probably all gone by now. So Amazon's going to sell them again. They're going to restock. Uh, within two weeks, so be patient. Do not pay overpay uh, more than a hundred dollars. Don't forget that Amazon offers that notification via email. So if you go to the link below, we'll supply it for the Eevee version or the Pikachu version. Just sign up for Amazon's notifications, and they'll let you know once it's available. Make sure you get on that real quick. And there's also another website. I'll put the link on the bar on the description below. I don't remember off the top of my head right now, but it actually helped me get the NES Classic. Mm -hmm. And what it does, it, it notifies you every time it's available. Mm -hmm. And if you connect it to your phone, it'll push a notification to it to uh -huh. let you know that it's available. That's pretty cool. So if you guys are interested in the Pikachu or the Eevee version and you really want the bundled edition, we'll put the links below to all these in all oh. these websites. Okay, so now let's talk about the game. My first impression, I, like I said, I only played a couple of hours. This reminds me so much of the yellow version of, of uh, Pokemon. Like I said, Pikachu is following you and in, in, uh, everywhere you go. Uh, the cool part about it is that you can see in the bushes when the Pokemons are coming out, the wild Pokemon that you can capture them. But once you touch them, you're going to interact. That's it. You're ready to go. If you have the ball, be very accurate because you could overthrow the ball and you're gonna miss it. Be very accurate. It's gonna tell you if you did an excellent job or a good job. Uh, if you did, if you did a good job, your chances of capturing it it's slim. But make sure you throw it in an excellent motion to capture the uh, the Pokemon. I had a hard time, but uh, once you get the hang of it, you will have fun. Once you capture your, your Pokemon, um, you get your Pokemon to party with the ones you carry, they, they get experience. So that's how you level up. My other impression about the game is that it brought me back memories of the first game I used to play. That was, was Game Boy Color. <laughs> oh man, yeah. Game you Boy know, Color. I remember, it actually brings back a quick memory. Uh, when we used to link up with the DS, with the uh, cable, yeah. and we used to play against each other. And that actually brought an idea. Back then we thought to ourselves, how cool would it be to be able to play with your friends online. You know, back then it was maybe about maybe what, eight, 10 years ago or so. Yeah, yeah. And you used to have to use a cable with, to connect two DS's, obviously the cable is like that. And to trade Pokemon. Yeah, yeah so you connect, could trade yeah. Pokemon. Yeah. But now you got the online capability. And that's what I was gonna ask you, since you already played it, did you get a chance to play the online version? Unfortunately, no, because I have nobody to play with right now. Uh, but I'm looking forward to it. If you guys have, please leave a comment below. What, what do you thought? Let Give us know. What, how do you feel about the online uh, capabilities of Pokemon? Unlike uh, Mario Party and all those damn... Yeah. Anyways, but that's not the case. Yeah, so 
Oh. <laughs> uh, surprise that I that I got from the game. Uh, I cannot say what exactly it is, but the gene leaders is uh, very very different from the first game from the yellow version that I remember or the previous games. So let us know what are your feelings uh, or how do you feel about this new Pokemon game? Do you think it was a ported version from the yellow edition from the DS? Um, what other Pokemon games have you guys played and which one is your favorite Pokemon game? Also, which one is your favorite Pokemon character? Yeah, good one. And uh, another thing, my impression with the couple hours that I play, it's worthy. Pick it up. Pick it up. If you could get the one with the ball, pick it up. You want that Mew on your team. Trust me, Mew is pretty strong. So pick it up guys. $100, don't pay more than $100. So what do you think? Are you gonna play tonight? Of course, I'm actually, as soon as we get out of here, I'm actually gonna go home and play it. There you go, so maybe we could battle. So, okay. I'm not battling you with, with level one Pikachu. What the heck is wrong with you? Hey, you're gonna make me look good. Oh, I forgot I trapped the rare one, right? So, okay. <laughs> so do you think this game is play worthy? I think it's play worthy. My thumbs up. Shoot, Mine too, too even up. though I haven't had a chance to play it, I'm really anxious to play it. You know, because this game is not only aimed towards kids, maybe three and up. I've actually seen grown, I wouldn't say only grown men, because I've seen also women in my work area that they actually, they're waiting in line to buy coffee at a local coffee shop. And I'm standing in line and I happen to look over the shoulder. What are they doing? Play, playing Pokemon Go. And then some guy at the market last time had two phones. And he's like this, and he's trying to capture Pokemon with two phones. Like, dude, you're gonna crash into the into the beer rack. Hey man, I know you would like to crash into it. It's a good rack. game, it's a popular game. Pick it up. Pick, pick it up. Yeah, pick that up. <laughs> pick it up. If you could pick it up with the ball, with the Pokeball Plus, please pick it up. Um, it comes with Mew. You want Mew on your team, so it's a very strong Pokemon and a rare Pokemon. That's the only way you can pick it up. Until next time guys, I'm Fizz, I'm Tech, see you guys later, bye.